Adorama TV presents Getting the Shot with Corey Rich. Hi, I'm Corey Rich, and you're watching Adorama TV. In this tech tip, I'm going to talk about the next level of Movi use. In the last tech tip, I described one man band small footprint production operation of the Movi M5. But the reality is oftentimes we are quote unquote a small footprint, which means it's not just me, it's a couple of us out there in the field. And my small footprint team, the team that I work with most, is key to really raising the bar when working with the Movi M10. The Movi M10 can handle a heavier payload. So we can put a Nikon D4S on the Movi M10, or we can even put a Red Dragon or a larger camera on the M10 and of course that allows us more flexibility in the types of shots we're capturing. We've now brought the Movi into pretty remote locations and we've used it in lots of environments from indoors to outdoors on bumpy dirt roads to flying it over snow-capped peaks and in our case the way that we operate is Sean Haverstock, my buddy who is really the, the tech guru for flying helicopters, operating the Movi and troubleshooting the gear when we break it. Sean is the man that's usually holding the Movi and right in the center of the action. And then myself and Dane Henry are typically behind two other small HD monitors and we each have a role. Dane has become the master of actually framing the shot using a set of controllers and I've become the guy that while I'm directing I can also be pulling focus with a remote follow focus rig. Sean is a fantastic helicopter pilot and so we now have one Movi M10 mounted to the bottom of the free fly heavy lifter. We use another Movi M10 that will oftentimes either mount to the end of our jib. Now the beauty of having the Movi on the bottom of the helicopter or on the end of a jib arm, it gives us the ability to constantly be reframing shots, focusing on our subject and we're rolling the whole time. Our productivity goes through the roof because we're never not capturing content. You know, once you start building a team, you're gonna start adding some accessories to your Movi. We use the Paralynx Aero Plus and the Paralynx Tomahawk depending on how far the Movi is from our team. We're also using small HD monitors so that everyone, whether follow focusing, framing, or actually operating the Movi can see the shot. By working with a team and using the Movi M10, you have the ability to really take your filmmaking to that next level, to really make some of those guys in Hollywood feel jealous of what you're capturing. The great enabler in this picture is the Movi, whether it's the M5 or the M10. Now it's about your creativity and imagination, mounting it to cool movement devices and pushing the limits creatively. The sky's the limit. Get out there and have fun, and I can't wait to see the shots you create. I'm Corey Rich. You're watching Adorama TV. Tons of free content just like this is published on a regular basis. So be sure to tune in. If you haven't subscribed to the YouTube channel, please do so. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for listening. Be sure to check out some of the Adorama contests. You have the opportunity to win some super cool stuff. Do you want great looking prints at low cost? Be sure to visit our easy to use online printing service. Adorama Pix has professionals who treat your images with the utmost care that you can count on. For a quick turnaround on photos, cards, or albums, use adoramapix.com.